Alright, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the Craig Sinks 96 Entertainment Network. And it's now time to go back to doing some more Let's Plays. This time I'm going to go ahead and do another Let's Play of Namco Museum 64. Or which, which I like to call the original Namco Museum. I mean, Namco Museum has been released multiple times under many systems. For the PlayStation, this console, which I'm playing on the Nintendo 64. And, of course, 50th Anniversary was released on, I believe, the Nintendo GameCube, the PlayStation 2, and the Xbox. But right now I'm playing the Nintendo 64 version of Namco Museum. And let's go ahead and start things off with everyone's favorite, Pac-Man. Oh, yes, I did forget to mention there are settings in this uh, game. One I hesitated to... One that I have hesitated to even show you guys in the original video that I did back in 2015. No, it was 2014, actually. Uh, but I did... But there are settings here in this uh, game. That was something I was solely reluctant to show, but I'm going to go ahead and use it anyway. Anyways, let's go ahead and get started. Wrong button. There we go. Try it again. Oops. Let's try this again, shall we? I want to try and refrain on getting all of these uh, big... Uh, oh, they're all coming, they're all coming, they're all coming. They're all coming. Yeah, now is as good a time as any. There we go. Again. Uh, whatever, I'll take a loss. Whatever. Perhaps I should focus less on evading the ghosts and just focus on getting all the pellets. level yet. Why is it that every time I am on the first level, I always lose two lives as a result? Honestly, I have played Miss Pac-Man a lot more than I did the original, honestly. I mean, I do like uh, the original Pac-Man, I just have a tendency to overlook uh, certain things, so... I mean, I, do, I am planning to do another Let's Play of Miss Pac-Man sometime soon, I just don't like it. Uh, not like that. Not like that. No! Oh. In this place, I'm, now, I'm probably not even going to get to level 5. Not this rate. Pressing the wrong button multiple times. Fuck all you. Ugh. Oh, 
Let's do it again. Stupid! 
Thank you! God damn! Alright. Down to level four. These AI, I don't know why these AI tend to get smarter and smarter every time I get every time I progress a little. I don't know why at all. Okay. No, you don't. No, you don't. There we go. And I'm surrounded. Damn it. And that's a game over. Nah, I'm not messing with the options here. Watch for Pinky, Blinky. Watch for Pinky. Blinky chases, Pinky ambushes, Inky scares easily, Clyde isn't very smart. I also don't know which one's Clyde, so. Use one way path. Use one-way paths near the ghost box. Ghosts can only travel in one direction. Use them wisely. Pac-Man can make sharper turns when ghosts are near him. Pac-Man will travel faster when there is no pellets in this path. Use these to your advantage. Fruit treats appear. Fruit treats appear when Pac-Man eats a certain amount of pellets. Munch on these for bonus points. Okay. Power pellets will allow. Pac-Man to eat the ghosts. He will also travel faster when the ghosts are blue. Okay. So I guess that's all the tips. And now we're going to go ahead and return to the main menu and go ahead and start with Miss Pac-Man. Now, we'll check the settings here first. And of course, the bo have the bonus right there. And now for the tips. Each ghost has certain char characteristics. Blinky chases, Pinky ambushes, Inky scares easily, and Sue isn't very smart. Miss Pac-Man can turn faster than the ghosts. She can also move faster when there are no dots in her path. When Miss Pac-Man eats 70 dots or 770 dots, a special treat will appear. Don't miss it or it'll disappear too soon. Each go- Okay, that's it. And now we can get started. How do you speed it up, though? Okay, I guess there's no speed up mode. I guess that's only in the Super Nintendo version. Or the Sega Genesis version. Are you kidding me? You gotta be kidding. Okay. Uh, and now they're coming after me again. Gotcha! Alright! Didn't lose a life there once. Alright. That'll be good enough for me.
lost already! Ah, ah, ah. Will you two leave me alone? Thank you. Thank you. And that's Act 1. Okay, good, 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 good. Good, 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 good. Boy! Bad boy! Bad boy! Bad, 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 bad! Ah! now. Ah! I pressed right, not down. Idiot. Stop going down when I'm clearly going right. Why do you do that? What the hell are you doing? Shorter, at the very least. 
Stage two, I haven't even gotten an extra life yet. Now, in the original Namco Museum, there are a lot more games you can play. Well, no, not. I mean, I mean, in the Namco Museum 50th anniversary, this is Namco 64 I'm playing. a couple more times. Of course, I'm going to play this again. try and go for the high score here. Stick the, and the uh, 
button. You only had one button for firing. You only had two of your button for firing. That was it. Stop missing. Alright, now time for stage five. Okay. Okay, you want me to sign my name? Oops! How about just... How about just B? I made a big mistake. Should have paid attention to entering my name instead of just looking at the scores. Now let's go ahead and take a look at the tips. As soon as you shoot all the information, the next one will be next one will appear. Let some enemies live to delay the next formation. If you are on the way to the corner, the enemies will trap you, so beware. When you're a dual fighter, take a hit. It will return as a normal fighter. Mem for the challenge stage, memorize the formation so you know where to go that sets that flies by. If a prisoner fighter is attacked, the fighter will be destroyed. Be very careful and only aim at the boss Galaga. Be careful when there are more fighters left and you are surrounded by a tractor beam, because the game will be over if you let if your last fighter is captured. Attack boss Galaga while he's flying. When a uh, boss Galaga with a captured fire is attack in formation, the enemy captured fighter will become your enemy. And that's it for the tips for Galaga. Now on to the next game. Galaxian. This is game number four in the series. Check the settings first. And let's get started. But first, tips. Beware of the last enemies. When there are only a few enemies left, they will attack in a zigzag or somersault pattern. You can kill enemies when they are doing a somersault because they can't fire at you. You cannot launch a missile until the previous one disappears. Kill enemies when they are close. When you kill the yellow galaxian, the other enemies' attacks will stop for the next few seconds. 
Kill tough, violent enemies during this time. Even if you are about to collide with an enemies, move to the left or right and shoot them down. Before killing the boss, kill both of his escort ships and gain 800 points. Kill the enemies quickly. If you take too long to destroy the formation, or there are only a few enemies left, they will start attacking very aggressively. And that's all for the tips, and let's go ahead and get started with Galaxian. Player one! That's me! Right in the line again. In the line. Ah! Not even the first level. Oh, of course, you can't see that's expected. Can't see that's funny. Motherfucker! Now, this game here, this is the answer to Space Invaders that was released back in, I'm not exactly sure when, in the 1970s or 80s when this game came out. I mean, I certainly know that the Atari, I mean, I certainly know, I mean, I know that, I believe, Space Invaders was released on the Atari 2600 back in the 80s. A game console which I've never owned because, well, I never actually owned an Atari system. In I mean, I have played Atari 2600 games before, I just never owned an actual system. Okay, here come the assault guys. Got him! Now for stage two!
That's it for Galaxian, I guess. And now we are on to pole position. Before I get started, let's go ahead and set the qualifying mode. Qualifying time limit. Extended time should be three. Okay, press A to accelerate, B, blah, 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 blah. Now to take on the tips. Getting started. Before you start, shift in the low gear and step on the gas. Change gears at 16 kilometers per hour. When you are accelerating, try to keep the car going straight. Don't turn too sharp. Stay in the middle of the road. If you turn too fast, you will crash and lose precious time. Learn when to brake and learn when to hit the gas to run out of turn. You must learn where and when to enter each turn. Even professional drivers must do this. Yeah, I don't really drive, so... Try to down into low gear or let off an accelerator to slow down for sharp turns. When approaching traffic, try to drive between them by positioning the car in the center of the track. Beware of cars that change lanes. Okay. Now to get started with pole position. Prepare to qualify. Yeah, I have this one set on easy difficulty. I didn't even hit the car. Did not even hit the car at all. That was a faker. What the fuck? Up. Yes, I know. And of course, I gotta keep going because I kept crash because I kept crashing. I crashed again. Maybe that's because I'm not breaking. Ah! That's uh, what I'm putting there. Let's try again. Prepare to qualify. Oh, what the fuck? I braked. Okay. Good, 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 good. I'm still... Oh! Time to race! Got puddles. 
race I'm in position three. Oh my that's a 69 boop Dad. survive the enemy attacks if you or keep them positioned when you are used a rock to kill them. You can get big bonus points by killing as many enemies as possible with one rock. Dig a tunnel under a rock, then group the enemy by pumping a little then dropping the then drop the rock. Pump enemies through thin walls. You can pump enemies from a path on the other side of the thin wall. A vegetable tree will appear if you drop two rocks. Alright, that's it for the tips. Now let's start the dig Player one, ready! Uh-oh, 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 uh-oh. 
Come here. Come here. That's a cheat game, that's a... 
fake cheat. Gotcha. What? Dog. Okay. All right. I'll accept your game over. But we get to continue anyhow. Okay. Your ass 
over here. Get both your asses over here. Die! And I'm killed. Entertainment Network. See you next time.